legit. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Um, somos del equipo de social media de Eventpro y estamos muy interesados en saber eh, qué tanto ha influenciado el 21st Century Breakdown, todo lo, el boom de, la, de las redes sociales y en segundo, eh, si son ustedes mismos los que manejan su Twitter y Facebook o si lo hace alguien más por ustedes. Hi guys. Hello. Media Group. Uh, they want. They have two questions. They want to know first if you, how much has been the influence of social media in all what has to do around 21st century breakdown tour. If it has influenced the media, the social media. And the second question they have is that if you handle out your own Twitter and the website, the Facebook, or if somebody else does it for you. Uh, we don't have a Facebook. That's everything. Not on Facebook. We do that. We we have no face. No, no, I hate Facebook. I think it's. Lo shit. odia. De hecho. Uh, uh, so that was the second question. First question. I think. Um, I think everything that uh, as far as television and the internet and uh, and uh, any kind of um, like uh, I, I I I love nonsense. Like, you know, I think it influences my songwriting a lot. Uh, just because it's uh, you try to make sense of uh, a world that makes absolutely no sense. It's just I have um, uh, any kind of chaos. I have uh, uh, sort of an affinity for so, and it kind of comes across in 21st century breakdown and American idiot. Eh, para ellos, la TV y internet han sido medios que han influenciado. Particularmente a él le encanta cualquier cosa caótica, entonces cualquier cosa caótica con la que se han tropezado ha influenciado grandemente el 21st Century Breakdown. Hola, eh, Jesús Rodríguez, 88.1 FM. Eh, me gustaría que me hablara sobre este nuevo trabajo 21st Century Breakdown y lo que significa como gira para ustedes. Uh, hi, 88.1 FM Radio. He wants to know uh, if, if you want, to, if you can talk to him about, if you can speak about this project, 21st Century Breakdown, and what it means for you. Uh, it was a, it was a difficult record to make. Um, but it was, um, um, you know, we were just trying to go into new territory, you know, breaking our own musical boundaries as much as we can, and. Um, and you know, and, and trying to uh, push ourselves as songwriters, and um, and trying to find new things that we believe in or don't believe in, uh, and in the, in the different influences around us, really. So, it's um, I think of like like 21st century breakdown. It's sort of um, it's like I I look at it as like the end of the Bush era where uh, American Idiot was right in the middle of the Bush era. So it's, um, I don't know if it's a continuation or anything, but it's, um, I think, finally something that had to be destroyed, which was uh, the George Bush administration, and then, uh, which was, and that's what 21st Century Breakdown is about, and it's about destroying something to start something new. Okay. Para ellos, musicalmente, fue una ruptura de, de fronteras. Ellos se empujaron como, fueron más allá de lo que ya habían hecho antes, como músicos, como compositores, y para ellos es una especie de fin de la época de Bush, de la administración de Bush. Y era como algo que ellos sentían que debía caer, y no sabían definirlo, pero es algo así como fin de un periodo. Hola muchachos, bienvenidos a Venezuela. Welcome to Venezuela. We are so excited you are here. Ah, oh, me too. Uh, my name is Jesus Conde, so Jesus Conde from Kiss of Hand, 101.5. Mm -hmm. um, I have two questions. Uh, first, uh, talk us about this show. 
Háblenos acerca de este show. What about this show? The show. Uh, yeah. And ¿Qué diferencia existe? Uh, what is the difference between uh, Basket Case, uh, Green Day, from, for example, 20, 21 Guns? ¿Qué ha pasado en este, en este tiempo con, con Green Day? Well, the difference between Basket Case... What happened along this time? It was he means at the end he speaks in Spanish and says what has been up to oh. Green Day during those two well, processes. Basket cases, uh, the biggest difference is that basket case is a lot faster than 21 guns. Basket cases is a poquito más rápido que 21 guns. Primero hay que And um, uh, what was the first question again? Uh, ¿Cuál era la primera pregunta? The show, the, show. No, the show is going to be a celebration. Es you know? una celebración. I mean, that's, you know, I mean, we celebrate, we, we've been a band for 22 years, we play for hours. There, there's, it's impossible to get us off the stage. Um, so, uh, you know, so that's what we expect from us, you know, and, and for the, the, the crowd is just to celebrate and have a great time and get drunk and party and um, have the time in their lives, as they say. Para ellos es una celebración, es un century breakdown. Eh, estamos juntos 22 años, han tocado por horas, entonces es imposible bajarlos del escenario y ellos lo que quieren es que la fanaticada se 